friends welcome to rectv education today we are going to discuss about accounting for bonus issue in this we need to study about meaning of bonus issue conditions for bonus issue source of bonus issue along with sebi guidelines and logic behind bonus issue so first we are going through meaning of bonus issue what is the meaning of bonus issue means without any consideration giving shares is known as bonus issue and next we have some conditions to satisfy for going to bonus issue those conditions are no default for payment of principal and interest of the debenture holders and your aoa provision should permit to bonus issue and next condition is shares are fully paid up and the last condition is that is reserve the similar benefits for the convertible debenture holders so friends let us discuss one by one for conditions no default for payment of principal and interest it means before going to issue bonus shares your company should not have any default in paying interest to the debenture holders or any principal to the debenture holders so the company should not have any default in the payment of principal and interest to the debenture holders if these conditions satisfy along with three conditions the company can issue bonus shares and next your aoa provision should authorize to issue bonus shares and the third condition shares are fully paid up so friends if your shares are partly paid up you should call what are the amount due for the bonus issue so first you have to call shares whatever the amount unpaid on the shares and after paying the full amount by the shareholders you can go through bonus issue and the last that is reserve for similar benefits for the convertible debenture holders so consider one example here for this condition now your authorized capital has 10 lakhs and you also issued fully 10 lakhs and you need in money for the more developments for your company so you are you need money so what you said means so some people you collected and you are uh, giving the debenture certificate and you are taking the money and you told that after some period goes your debentures should will be convertible to equity shares so you have a convertible debentures now after that you are going for bonus issue now these debenture holders also ask the, you that what about our bonus shares it means as though they are debentures but the company has promised it will be converted into equity shares so for that reason you should reserve some bonus shares to these type of debentures also that is convertible debentures that is all the four conditions if you satisfy you can go through bonus issue i what are the source of bonus issue along with sebi guidelines now let us see what are the sources to issue bonus shares now what are the sources of bonus issue along with sebi guidelines in this we have two segments that is for issue of bonus shares to fully paid up shares and for issue of bonus shares for partly paid up shares so friends for issue of bonus shares to fully paid up shares we can use the reserves like capital redemption reserve securities premium and capital reserve and free reserves and surplus and for issue of bonus shares for partly paid up shares we can use the reserves like capital reserve and free reserves and surplus and here cap capital redemption reserve means already we have seen cpt it is only used for the bonus issue and when we goes to securities premium only whatever the amount it is realized in the cash we are going to use for the bonus issue and capital reserve capital reserve means what is the capital income minus capital expenditure whatever the income you are derived from that you are going to transfer to capital reserve so this also you can use for bonus issue and free reserves and surpluses here free reserves and surpluses not only for the bonus issue you can also use for any business purpose and when we are going through for issue of bonus shares for partly paid up shares we have only two sources that is capital reserve and free reserves and surpluses now what is the logic behind bonus issue 
let us consider that now you had a company and you will prepare trading and profit and loss account every year after preparing your trading and profit and loss account you will derive a net profit from this you are going to pay dividend to your preference shareholders and your equity shareholders so after paying your preference shareholders a entire profit is going to to equity shareholders so from here although you are paying tax on this net profit after that if you are going to give dividend to your shareholders again you have to pay dividend distribution tax so there is a double taxation and there is a extra cost to your company for this reason to avoid cost and also some of the expenditure like dividend distribution tax the company is going to issue bonus shares and how these are issued means now what we have seen the sources of bonus issue so from that reserves you will transfer the amount to equity share capital so your shares will increase along with capital so on the liability side reserves will decrease and the share capital will increase so there is no change in the balance sheet by this reason you are issuing bonus to your equity shareholders in this way they are getting whatever the amount they have to get dividend in the form of bonus shares and also if they want to sell it they can sell at a profit that is if they sell at a premium or it, although it got a free of cost so if they are sells they uh, the entire amount whatever the equity shareholders are getting it is a profit so indirect way they are getting the dividend suppose if you don't give in the form of bonus shares now you have to pay dividend to them and you have to also pay dividend distribution tax so for this reason there is a topic came that is bonus issue so with this we have completed four segments that is meaning of bonus issue conditions for bonus issue and source of bonus issue and also lost that logic behind bonus issue so this is a small topic we have completed bonus accounting for bonus shares now let us see one problem let us see one question based on accounting for bonus issue so left hand side we have a question part and the right hand side we have a solution part and let us see question part first so here 40000 equity shares of 10 each that is 1 lakh 4 lakhs and capital reserve including 30000 profit on sale of machinery amounts to 75000 capital redemption reserve 25000 secretaries premium 30000 and general reserve 1 lakh 5000 and profit and loss account credit balance it shows 50000 now the company decided to issue equity share holders bonus shares at the rate of one share for every four shares so for every four shares the company is going to one bonus issue so we have to prepare general entries so now let us come to the solution part so here capital reserve account shows that is 30000 being profit and sale of machinery so this 30000 we are going to use for bonus issue 30000 and the crr account shows 25000 that is capital redemption reserve shows 25000 it is also using for bonus issue and the securities premium 30000 and the general reserve 50000 so we need how these amounts are derived and what are, what is the correct that we have taken one lakh for this we have one note that is for every four shares we are issuing one bonus share so what about 40000 shares so we are going to issue 10000 bonus shares so 10000 bonus shares into 10 rupees each so the amount comes to 1 lakh so that's why the bonus to bonus to shareholders account shows 1 lakh here and the this being issue of one share for every four shares this is a narration and our next entry is that bonus to shareholders account data to equity share capital account 1 lakh 1 lakh so friends after transferring to bonus to shareholders account after that you have to transfer this amount to equity share capital account so the entry becomes 
bonus to shareholders account data to equity share capital account 1 lakh 1 lakh being capitalization of profit so with this problem we have a clear idea about accounting treatment for bonus issue so friends with this we have completed accounting for bonus issue with concept and also with example in next video we are going to discuss about internal reconstruction thank you